Hi everyone, today I'm going to share with you my review of this wireless microphone for saxophone and brass instruments, which may be the best low budget wireless microphone. For those of you who don't know me, I'm a saxophonist, teacher and producer. I played in different venues and I've always wanted to find the best equipment in order to achieve the best performance. And here is what I found. This SG Pro D333 is a great microphone for a low price and high quality. I filmed for you the first unboxing of this product. And when you open it for the first time, you find the manual. And here is the microphone itself, which you have to combine to its transmitter. And there's a clamp to attach it to the saxophone or whatever instrument you play. After that, there is the power supply of the receiver and also a second lateral microphone, which can be very useful. There are also some cables included. Uh, for example, there's a jack and a micro USB to charge the transmitter. And the most important piece, of course, is the receiver that comes with two powerful antennas, which are very easy to mount. Let's start with saying that I'm using the Laverel microphone right now to record the audio of this review and the sound quality is good in my opinion. There is no perceived latency when you use it on live stage and the spec says that the range of the receiver is of 80 meters, which is a lot. And let me tell you that it's true only if there is no obstacles in between the receiver and the transmitter. Keep also in mind that at higher distances, like 20 or 30 meters, you start to hear some latency in the sound. But for the majority of events, it's fine. And I can tell you in my experience that I never had problem of distance. Just only once when I played in front of 2000 people at a festival and I got off the stage to play in the middle of the crowd, something like 20 meters away from the receiver. And I started losing a signal but other than that, I feel that those are powerful wireless microphones based on their low price. As for the effects, this receiver comes with built-in equalizer and reverb. And I personally like to raise the high frequencies uh, up to 3 decibels. And occasionally I also use the built-in reverb. The receiver is perfect for the biggest stages and for greater distances, but if you're for example a busker and you're without AC supply I wanted to talk about a smaller option which in my opinion is amazing this SG Pro T15 is built from the same company and it's the smallest portable wireless solution I found for a great sound quality and built-in effects if you're a busker that's definitely the best option that's what I think I've been using this microphone for the past few months and I have to say I'm really impressed with its performance. It also has different equalizer and reverb presets by its own, which is very useful. And this setup process is very simple. It took me just a few seconds to get everything connected and ready to go. The microphone comes with a transmitter and receiver, which are both very lightweight and easy to handle. One of the things I really love about this microphone is that it's very durable. I've taken it on lots of performances and I have to say that it's built very well. Also, the duration of the battery is very good and it lasts around three to four hours. Another amazing feature is the mute button that you can press on the transmitter and gives you the, the ability to mute whenever you like the signal. And I ended up using it a lot in my performances. Overall, I'm very happy with these two microphones. It's a great value for the price and I would definitely recommend it to you if you're a saxophonist or a brass instrument player, if you're looking for a reliable wireless option. If you're interested, you can find the links to those two wireless microphones in the description below. And let me know your experience with microphones and write down in the comments which microphone you are using for your live performances. Thanks a lot for watching 
and uh, if you consider this to be useful information please leave a like and subscribe to my channel for the next saxophone related videos